Hello there guys, what is up? Welcome to Heracross Gaming, and today's video is Valet. This game has recently hit the PlayStation Network, it looked really awesome. So without further ado, let's get into it. Oh, we can select our gender, choose male or female. Um, for the sake of consistency, and because I am one, male. Hey, looks like I missed you. I just wanted to wish you luck before you headed out. I still can't believe you're doing this. I mean, hunting down the, what was it? The life seed? Gotta admit, that sounds crazy. I mean, even if this mythological thing that can shatter worlds or whatever actually exists, what are the chances of you tracking down this ancient relic in the middle of the Rocky Mountains? Listen, I know you want to prove the thing exists. I, I get that. It's an adventure. Hell, it's your career, but can't you do something normal like the rest of us and just backpack Europe or something? Spend a month in Thailand? But hey, if by some miracle you find this thing and become the most famous archaeologist of all time, Beers are on me. I'll even trade in your tinfoil hat for a whip and fedora. I just really hope all those canoeing lessons pay off. Okay, so here we are. We are in the Rocky Mountains to start this game off. As I said, it's in the first person mode, so... If we run into anything, you'll be seeing this at the same time that I do. So we are looking for the life seed. This appears to be some sort of artifact that has eluded archaeologists since the dawn of its inception. Or without we'll find it in the first five minutes, or without we'll find it looking in here. By holding L2 we can actually run. Unlike everybody's gone to the rapture, which you can't. Holy... wow. What we experience, we'll be experiencing together. It may be disappointing, it may be life-altering. What the hell? What are you? What, 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 what are you? Dad, get away from me! Uh oh. An old army truck. Must have crashed here years ago. Oh. Oh, what the? So this is the Leaf Suit, as you just saw from that 1940s propaganda promo footage. This would have been a suit that would have been used to combat the enemy. I'm guessing this was in the States, so this would have been the German Air Forces. I'm running back, I want to go to that waterfall. Sorry guys, quick detour here. I want to head back to the waterfall. Because now I can jump really high. I can see things that I couldn't see before, and I can access areas that I couldn't before. Holy... This this is insane! This is amazing. What? Note to self, uh, we cannot do that. We cannot jump into water. But we can get some elevation going here. We can jump at amazing speeds. Where, where, where am I going? I'm running so fast I can't even see what's in front of me. I feel like the prototype for Iron Man. Run down slopes to gain momentum to jump higher and further. Oh boy. Holy crap, that was awesome. I can see my shadow. 
Can you see my shadow? I can. The implemented half machine, half human. Just can keep heading this way. Keep going, keep going, keep going. I'm gonna try and speed this up for you guys. Just try and... Okay, so it stores energy. Holy... No way. We can actually shoot things. We can bring things back to life. That's fine. This is this is amazing. Can we make this? Can we make this jump? Yes, we can. Oh, I messed up there. I was supposed to take... I don't want to take the life of the deer. That's cruel. I don't care if we can bring them back to life. I changed my mind. I said that was cool. I changed my mind. Quest updated. Find a way towards the ancient ruins. Wow, what the... Some sort of firefly burning leaf combination? I don't like the look of that. That looks... That looks menacing. I don't really want to go through there. Oh, we give life to the trees. Seems like this fireflies react to energy. Gonna head over here. Okay, so a little bit of puzzle action there. I brought life back to the trees, and these appear to be good guys. Energy upgrades. Yay. A game like this could easily flip on you. Something could come from out of nowhere. We are in the Susurus Valley. So even though we have free movement, uh, there appears to be a certain pathway. It looks like it branches out, but it's actually quite linear. So I actually was wrong about that. But we're going to continue onwards. Uh-oh. What the? The Leaf Valley suits quantum death functionality allows the user to return to life after dying. So as long as I'm wearing the Leaf suit, I am impervious to death. Was that supposed to happen or was I just not quick enough? Yeah, that was supposed to happen because it's reset the bridge so that I can jump over and do this and just barely make that jump. But life must be traded for life. The more you die, the more the valley will die around you until it's fully deadened. Without enough life in the valley, you cannot be revived. Yay! It's clear to me that the natives of the valley worshipped the giant tree here almost as a deity. Great lengths were taken to construct obelisks around this tree, which the ancients used to help grow it. I've begun to use the term Titan Tree to designate this deity. According to my interpretation, once every thousand years, the Titan Tree will produce the mythological and famed Life Seed, said to possess the power to shatter the world into fragments. No wonder the military is so interested in this place. So this tree, as the narration suggests, produces the life seed. Those acorn doors are pretty neat. Captain Hall ordered us to collect enough acorns to open all the passageways in Sector 3. I'm about halfway there. Okay, so the acorns open special doors. Yggdrasil of Norse mythology. I'm not thinking properly because I'm just enjoying running around like a child, just jumping off of things. I love it. It's like an open world where you are almost like a demigod. 
Obviously there are consequences to your actions, so be careful. But like anything, without action and consequence, you have nothing. I'm flying! Hey, come back here. I wanna chase you. Little glowworm thingies. The art style is awesome. I, I really like the engine that they've used for this. Oh, no, no, not fa not falling for that again. No, not falling for that again. One eternity later. Just jump down here without taking too much damage or... Okay guys, I think I'll call it there for now. I'll call it a session because uh, I just keep forgetting that the leaf suit is not impervious to water. I've really enjoyed this so far. Um, I may do some more if you guys want to see some more. Let me know in the comment section below. I'm going to call it a session for now. I've been Heracross Gaming. This has been Valley. And I'll see you guys in the next one.